An SUV plunges into a Warren County pond inside a mother and her child. New at 530, we hear from the man who jumped in and pulled that kid to safety. And on your side, Scott Wagner has the story from Mainville. The serenity of swans swimming at this pond in a Mainville subdivision was shattered Monday. What in the heck is that? A woman with a child in the back seat suffered a medical emergency and blacked out. I remember my girlfriend saying, go babe. Robert Timmy was in his backyard. He saw the mother's vehicle driving straight into the water. Ran down the, the walking path as quick as I could and just dove in. He and other neighbors Joshua Whitehead and Richard Cohen swam down to the sinking SUV. And there was a little boy back just screaming frantically. They were able to get the boy's door open and pull him to safety. But now with the car quickly filling with water, Robert had to try and calm the mother down with something she didn't want to hear. We need the vehicle to equalize. It needs to go underwater. Just, just give it a second and hold your breath. Robert knew because of the pressure the car had to fill nearly completely with water before we grabbed that door and it just popped right open little did anyone know robert was not relying on any training he says he learned it on the tv show mythbusters so i remembered seeing that and and it worked emergency crews then rescued the family from the rooftop of their sunken suv ironically a ford escape she was okay and their boy was okay Robert doesn't see himself as any kind of hero, especially given the holiday. Memorial Day is all about heroes. It's about those who, those who serve the country and died for this country. Those are the true heroes. I don't feel like a hero. I just reacted. Scott Wegener, 9 on your side, Hamilton Township.